Uh, is there any particular, you know, actionable insight that you hope the listeners will take with them after a conversation today? Yeah, absolutely. Be, be fiercely curious of what the possibilities may be. And that might mean meaning, you know, uh, logging on to the Domus Hermeticus dot world website and checking it out because there's a ton of information on there. And then there, there are, you know, if it, if it calls you there, there are alchemy uh, course work there. That's very inexpensive. It's Dennis's work that he's pioneered over the last 30, 40 years. Um, and it's all there for you. Now we're, we have Dennis's entire school on our website. And so there are ways to learn about it, but there's a lot of free resources. You can look and see if that's of interest in something you do. But I, I can tell you this, yeah. that modern psychology, a lot of it, the Jungian side, was based yeah. on alchemy. And he had the largest alchemical library in the world. And he did a lot of the work. And I won't dive too deep into this now because it's a bit complicated, but on archetypes, there's things that are similar in the human human consciousness uh, work that he teased from the alchemical images. And so all that, you know, there's a lot of resources. I mean, you can go as deep or as shallow as you want. There's no right or wrong. And again, if it calls you, great. If it doesn't, at least you've got resources to see and say, oh, okay, this is good, not for me. Or this is great. How do I, how do I learn more? And there's there's resources for all of that on there. Right. Yeah. So that's that's amazing that there's tools for everyone, you know, from the curious explorer to like, you know, the committed uh, seeker. And and it's gotten curious, more curious, like, you know, where do you see your work evolving in the next few, few years? Well, you know, uh, maybe you know, what's the big vision, you know, uh, for the future? Uh, it's don't very grandiose. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> So again, um, the mover and shaker in all this in the Domus is Christiana. And okay. even though I'm co-founder, I really credit her with this project and what she's done with it. And she's done the bulk of the work, uh, organizing the faculty, getting the website, getting all the logistics done, a ton of research. Um, yeah. and, and, and so the vision that, that we're bringing is to really bring this out into the much larger universe to, you know, it's really time for, for people to discover what alchemy actually is instead of just banding the name about and seeing how it fits into the contemporary world, like you said. So we're building more and more resources out for that to happen. And, um, you know, we, we're, th what we've already done and which he's already done with the site has been off the charts amazing and i'm just really honored to be a part of it and to lend right. you know my pieces to it and um my sense is that this is really going to serve the world community so yeah it is grandiose and it kind of has to be at this point uh the world is not healing it itself let's just say oh. evolution is very slow and hopefully this is one way to help move that and, and to build more bridges, which is why we're doing a lot of cross-cultural alchemy work in what we're doing, uh, because there are so many bridges to build. And, and that's, again, why I do a lot of work and I do these pilgrimages and travel all over and meet with folks. And uh, there's so much potential. Once we get out of our own way, I'll go back to that phrase yeah. again. You know. So we think that's the, that's the most important uh, thing is getting out of our own way and yeah. and um, it's inspiring to see how you bridge an ancient knowledge with modern day transformation. Um, it's clear that you, you you're doing the potential. You know, I mean, what you're doing has the potential to make some some lasting impact here across uh, many lives, many industries. Uh, I can't I can't wait to see where it goes. You know, uh, I'm, I'm pretty you know pretty excited about it and. Um, you know, it's got it's got my it's got my interest again. You know, because like I said, I you know I had left left um, what I was learning to the side because you know I didn't really have you know someone who had the compass uh, to to lead me uh, mm -hmm. in the correct way. 
Uh, so, you know, it was it, it became very confusing for me, very frustrating. And, I, and I, I'm sure I'm not the only one out there who's kind of who's been uh, kind of lost that way. Um, yeah. 